How's it going, Fatal Family? Fatal Steven here, and now 2K23 is already out in New Zealand, so people are able to get their hands on it and dig into the files, and there's some stuff in the files that has already been found, and some are actually insane. Now, these will eventually be uploaded to the communications once, you know, shit gets bypassed, but also the cake tools, the mod tools that are needed are not out yet. So it might be a little bit until these models get officially uploaded to the communications, but I can guarantee that these models will eventually make it on the communication. So let's get into what's found so far. So all these models are my faction, of course, because they're going to go hard in the paint with my faction this year. But the first one is AJ Styles WrestleMania 33 from my faction in 2K22. It's still in the files for 2K23, which means that we will have another AJ Styles model to play with besides the AJ Styles retro model that's in showcase. And this is the model 2K23. It's the same model from 2K22. Again, it's going to be tied behind my faction. So expect like a lot of old my faction packs to transfer into 2K23 as well, as well as new my faction packs exclusive to 2K23. So the first one is AJ Styles, and I really like this attire in him. It sucks that it's going to be tied behind my faction because I think we only have AJ Styles retro to use in game. So we're going to have this AJ Styles tied behind my faction. So I can't wait for this one to go in the communications. The next one is also a pack from 2K22, and that is the New Day pack. The first one we have is Big E rocking the same singlet, and you can see in the background they're currently in the Clash of the Castle arena, and you can also see it's a 2K23 in the background there. So this is definitely 2K23, it's not 2K22, it's just the same my faction model from 2K22 into 2K23. Next up, someone found that there's a red and black hair Zelina in one of the My Faction cards. So hopefully that card actually has a model tied to her that looks exactly like that, you know, with the black and red hair. Because then that model can also be uploaded to the community creations. That model has not been found yet, just the card. Next up, the same hidden Drew McIntyre from 2K22 is still in 2K23's files. And it's the one that's based on his look from 2020. And the gear is still glitched on it, which I find hilarious. As you can see, the gear still has clipping issues when it comes to the trunks and the wristbands. Next up, there's actually a Brock Lesnar double title victory motion in the game due to showcase mode. Now this double title victory motion for Brock Lesnar isn't something that you can just go through the list and pick. It's actually just tied to showcase mode when Brock Lesnar wins against John Cena, he puts the titles up. However, this victory motion can and will be uploaded to the communications for you to download and then copy it to your Brock Lesnar in game. So I'm looking forward to that. Next up, we got a Kofi Kingston to go alongside New Day and Xavier Woods. This Kofi Kingston seems a little different than this 2K22 model for some reason. I don't know what it is with it. Maybe the, the chest or something looks different, but it's rocking the same attire as that New Day pack. And again, it's going to be my faction exclusive, and it will eventually be on the community creations. So as you can see, even though it's a 2K22 my faction model, in 2K23, the models actually look a lot better, the lighting. So it actually looks like a new model, even though it's a 2K22 my faction model. Next up, we have a new Stone Cold that's in my faction with like the metal knee braces. Looks absolutely stunning, especially in 2K23. And this Stone Cold seems to be rocking a broken skull shirt, which is really cool, and a skull ring on his hand. Now, the unfortunate part is most of these my faction models, their attires are blocked and cannot be uploaded. Just their models and their attires have to be recreated. But hopefully this year it's different, and hopefully this year the attires can also be uploaded to the community creations alongside the model. If not, recreating these attires won't be a problem because the community is so talented that they can recreate these attires near perfect. But this Stone Cold looks spot on and I really can't wait to download them. Next up, completing the New Day pack, we obviously have Xavier Woods. Again, it's an old model from 2K22, my faction, but it just looks a lot better in 2K23. The lighting, just the way it looks, the way the color on the attire pops. So again, we have an Xavier Woods. So all three New Day members have a my faction model in 2K23 as well. Next up is the insane one. This one's insane. There's a John Cena action figure model in 2K23 for my faction, unfortunately. But just look how articulated and detailed that this this model looks like it's actually insane it looks like a it actually looks like an action figure 2k23 went so hard with this model obviously because it's my faction exclusive but this model looks absolutely insane and the fact that this right here is tied behind my faction is just going to prove to us the problem that my faction is going to be this year we're going to get amazing models i already know it we're going to get amazing models top-notch models brand new ones new variations like this in my faction only and if it wasn't for the community creations we would be shit out of luck with this but we have john cena action figure model which i cannot wait to get my hands on and i really hope that this can be uploaded as soon as possible but just look how it looks like in game even with it in the ring this action figure model it looks like a mod it looks like one of those mods that i cover in my mod videos it literally just looks like someone ripped a model from a different game and put it to get 23 but no 
It's an actual model to get 23 from my faction modes. So be on the lookout for all these models. Once they're uploaded on the community creations, I will be making a video on how to download them and when they're available to download. So, so be sure to like the video and subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss out when these models are uploaded. And finally, we all know Rhea's infamous pin, right? You know, the sus pin. Well, that pin is actually in 2K23 for my rise mode and my rise mode only, unfortunately, in a cutscene. So this pin for Rhea is actually not in the game besides this cutscene, which kind of blows my mind because like, why would you animate this pin for the cutscene, but not allow us to use this pin when we're playing the game? Hopefully someone can like upload a modded moveset that includes this Rhea pin for us to then copy on Rhea. And if so, of course, I will cover that too. So that right there's all the current new stuff that's coming up to 2K23. Obviously, the game is not officially out yet until Tuesday. And once these models are uploaded on the community creations, I will keep you guys up to date immediately. Thanks for watching, guys. Fatal Steven out. Peace.